Greetings. This is Lotus Speaks for Fit to Be Goddess. And um, Fit to Be Goddess is my baby. Fit to Be Goddess will be a year old this month, actually, November 11th. And Fit to Be Goddess started off as a blog. And it was just a blog about my journey to health and wellness. I was 28 years old and I was suffering from a disease called super morbid obesity. And super morbid obesity, um, it's sorry, is when you are 200 or more pounds overweight. And I was 200 pounds overweight. I was 368 pounds. And I was 28 years old and I was sick. I was tired. I, I was winded going from the grocery store. I, I didn't have energy to chase my children around. And I was really on a road to my destruction and I decided that I wanted to live. So Fit to Be Goddess was about me deciding to live initially. It was just a little blog and I got up there and I had Ross take pictures of me naked with the 368 pounds, the back flaps and everything. And then this was the end of that cycle of my life. And I cried and I went through this emotional thing and the universe was comforting me and letting me know that I had to set an example and that I would never be there again. So I took on this responsibility and my mission here and uh, Fit to be Goddess and we are, you can see my little banner, Companions on a Journey to Health and Wellness. That's what we're here for. And um, we're talking about health, and it's not just diet and exercise, but mentally, spiritually, emotional, physically, sexual, financial. Holistic health. And um, you can't, you need all of those aspects to be completely well. And this is my journey, and I'm here to help you on your journey as well. And um, now, I, you know, I like to talk a lot. Um, I always talk about cleansing and health and of course because you know the presence of mucus and acid in our bodies is the disease the one disease that we have that everyone has whether it's in your lungs it's asthma your pancreas diabetes whatever your blood herpes lupus sickle cell any of those things it all has to do with cleansing and we can reverse disease by cleansing period and to prevent disease by having uh, alkaline electric acid list and mucus list diet is really exciting so i was 368 pounds and i was on the road to killing myself as of today i have lost 151 pounds so i'm 217 pounds today and this is without surgery they wanted to give me surgery they were so excited to see me they wanted to cut me they wanted to give me the lap band they wanted me to take um weight burners fat burners pills i, I declined all of that stuff and I went on the holistic path, intracellular cleansing, fasting, alkaline, electric diet, and here I am. So, Fit to Be Goddess is here as your tool, as your companion on the journey to health and wellness. Today, I want to talk about womb wellness because a lot of the times I talk to sisters and they're experiencing really bad menstrual cycles. And I look on Facebook and they're like, I'm so in so much pain. I just took so many Motrin. I just took so many Midols and all this stuff. I used to have that too. I used to have the worst menstrual cycle. I used to bleed for seven days. I used to bleed gushing blood. I used to have to stay home from school because my cycle was so bad. I used to be in pain. I used to be vomiting, curled over for the first two, two to three days of my cycle. And I would bleed extensively and I had a lot of pain. And, you know, I talk about pain. It's caused by acid and acid in our bloodstreams. And that's the same thing in reference to um, our cycles. So when we change our diet to our alkaline diet, we will not experience the pain anymore. No more mitos will be necessary. No more big ass pads because you're bleeding so much. You can completely reverse that. You can completely reverse the pain and you can cleanse your cycle away, period. And you can still be be able to reproduce and all of those things with, without the deterioration of your uterus because that's what happens when we shed that blood. We are, our, our, our uterus is being deteriorated when we have our menstrual cycle. And that's why you experience the pain and it's the shedding of the endometrium. You don't have to go through that experience. It's awful. And I know what someone's going to say, well, that's what the Bible says and 
all this stuff and you have to suffer and bear babies and all this crap. But the reality is you don't have to be in pain, period. And I can speak from my own experience and example that my period was seven days to four days to two days. Maybe now two days. I'm on my cycle right now. I don't get the breakouts like I used to get. And anything that has to do with your skin has to do with your blood. If you see anything, eczema, uh, cirrhosis, um, all of that stuff has to do with the impurities in your blood. Once you cleanse your blood, your skin will be clear. For those of you who are like, oh, your skin, huh? you used to wear foundation. I used to wear foundation. I do not wear foundation anymore. This is just my diet. Um, you, and I, like I said, I don't have a period yet. I have two days of spotting, and that's it. And I don't know, like, I know because I count the days of my ovulation when my cycle is going to come, but I don't know because of cramping, cravings, anything like that. I don't experience any of those things on an alkaline diet. Now, some of you say, well, I eat right, and I still have pain. Well, I'm a vegetarian, I still have pain. Are you a vegetarian, or are you a starchitarian? Is most of your food starch? Because that is acid, too. So you have to really think, like, do I really want to, some of you will choose to eat whatever you want and pop a whole bunch of pills every time your cycle comes on to eat your own. But for those of you who are tired of experiencing that, I'm here to tell you that you don't have to experience that anymore. And this is something that I share with the members of my website, information like this. So um, my website is www.fitcobe. G O D D E S S dot com. That's fit to be goddess dot com. All those letters, that whole big thing. But um, also, I wanted to touch upon like, even if you do have a, a diet that is alkaline, you might say, well, I eat this stuff and I still, I eat well. Maybe, maybe you don't drink enough water. I don't know. But whatever it is, I'm saying is, none of you have to experience pain. They can say, well, that's only you. No, none of you have to experience pain. I had a sister who was here doing an intensive earlier this year. Her name is Aaliyah. And uh, she had fibroid tumors. And she had fibroid tumors for years and years and years. And a couple years prior, they had removed fibroid tumors the size of golf balls, and they grew back. When she was here at my house on an intensive intracellular cleansing, fasting, she literally passed fib her fibroid tumors in the bathroom, in the toilet, I saw them. No surgery, could remove them, they grew back. Through cleansing, she passed them in the toilet. I looked at them, I seen them with my own eyes. Fibroids in the toilet. You don't have to be in pain. You don't have to be sick. You can choose to live. You can choose to reverse whatever thing is going on with you. You don't have to be in pain. The other thing I wanted to touch upon is the acid, sperm. You're like, well, I eat right, I do this, I do this, I still experience pain, I'm still having these problems. What is your mate eating? What is he doing? Because if you are having sex with someone and you are allowing him to ejaculate in your vagina and his diet is acid, his sperm is acid, and that could be detrimental to your uterus, to your vagina, to your womb, to your reproductive system, period. So you have to be really mindful of that, that it's whomever you choose to be intimate with. What is their diet? Because their acid, sperm, can affect your body as well. And this is more things that we like to get into for the members of Fit to Be Goddess of the website. And that's www.fitobegoddess.com. And um, that's going to be all for now. Until next time, I will see you on Facebook. Oh, wait. One more thing. Finally, I remember it. Universal Love is here. Universal Love is my baby. I made this compound myself. I take this compound. I've been taking this compound since I made her. It is awesome. For those of you who are interested in that womb wellness that I spoke about, we, this will assist, assist you on your menstrual cycle. This will help to, um, to make your body alkaline. This will also feed you on a cellular level. This also relaxes the central nervous system. This is, has burdock in it, which is a blood purifier. Um, kelp has in it um, a whole bunch of other, some other sea vegetation and um, plant vegetation. Completely natural, no drugs. This is actually food. 
you can take this in, in place of food with water. Um, you can put it in your mouth. It's a powder. You can put it straight in your mouth. You drink some water down like that. You can mix it with some fruit in a juice blender, and like a smoothie. You can um, you can have this and along with the alkaline diet. But this has all the minerals that your body needs to sustain itself. Period. Point blank. Plus some more stuff uh, to shrink tumors, balance the thyroid, everything. So. This is also, this is Universe Cell Love, and it's also available on fit2begoddess.com. So, love and light and peace and darkness and silence and happiness and everything to you all. And I'll talk to you next time.